every year older is another year fitter it's an actual belief inside your brain i think society's brains that as you get older your fitness decreases your health and fitness goes down so it's like oh yeah you're getting old now so it's okay to put on a bit of weight and all this stuff i've actually realized it's the other way around i'm like the older i get the fitter i'm gonna get i'm just gonna continue to get fitter all right because i'm not gonna stop going to the gym so every single year that's another year that's not another year older a lot of people think it's another year older but it's not it's another year where you've lifted a little bit more ran a little bit further eaten a little bit better it's another year better we need to all as a society i think start changing our focus and look at it as a progression we can get fitter as we get older we can be in better shape as we get older that one single thought which is what if it could be me what if i could do it you know that sort of sparks all of these uh, amazing ideas in your brain and then what happens because you start getting restless is you then start going out and start doing those little things all of these why questions they're going to start sparking some beautiful solutions man and who knows it could could change your life what are you waiting for how many things have you got in your mind that you've been just talking about for years you got to be careful because if you're not you're going to get to the end of your life and still be telling someone about all the things that you're going to do one day you've got to take action now Stop talking about what you want and what you're going to do and go out and get it, baby. The easy thing to do is just to roll over, to lie there and let life treat you like a little bitch, to hold your hands up and say, this is just the way life is. These moments in life are always going to be there. Don't think for one second there comes a stage in your life where this doesn't happen. But what you've got to start to do is to take back control of your life. Because the minute you tell yourself that you control this shit, is the minute you can start to change it. People are going to think you're mad. They're going to tell you shit like, it ain't possible, it's risky, you shouldn't do it, be careful. These people have to see shit to believe it, but you need to believe it to see it. Believe that you can do it and work hard to get it and it's yours. Work on yourself daily. Work on the way you look at the world around you. Look at solutions rather than focusing on all the problems and never give in. Let's start with a metaphor. I want you to think about your life like a book. A book is divided into chapters. Some chapters are boring and a grind to get through, and others are exciting and you hope they never end. And right now, you're in a chapter. Maybe this chapter of your life is a grind. It's overwhelming and unsatisfying and you feel stuck reading it over and over again. Maybe you want to start a new chapter, but you don't know what the next chapter is about, and so you keep rereading the one you're currently in. Here's the greatest thing about life. You don't have to know where this next chapter is going. You just have to start writing it. I want you to envision a blank page. What do you want to write? What do you see for yourself? I don't want you to try to figure out what job or business you should write on that page. What belongs on that page are the dreams that you have for yourself and your life. And all that's required to start writing is to start saying yes instead of telling yourself no. Yes, you should start that podcast. Yes, you should go back to school. Yes, you should try to launch that business. Whatever it is that you've been doing, whether you're three years out of college and it's a job you can't stand from a major you hate, or it's a 20-year career that you're just burnt out on, or maybe you stepped away from the workforce to raise your kids, or perhaps like so many people right now, you've been laid off. This is the moment to write your next chapter. You're not too late. You're right on time. All you need is a blank page and a pen. Here, you can use mine.